So, hi everyone, Starbucks here, welcome back to another video. So, I didn't think I was gonna make another video on this channel, but I was lucky enough to get Grifania from the uh, summoning, um, using the tickets I got from the treasure cave. By the way, that event is, uh, is amazing, and I was able to rank her level 120. So, she's my first ancestor, and I really wanted her since she came out, and she's been one of my favorite monsters ever, so yeah. So in this video I'm gonna make a quick review on this monster, um, I'm gonna talk about some different combinations I could, you could use for this monster and stuff because I've been just having a lot of fun doing that, so yeah. The skills I'm running are Armored Pick for a lot of damage for zero stamina, Pick and Flight for the Pierce, a Hurricane instead of um, Divine Flutter because it has a zero cooldown and no wait. Yeah, zero cooldown and lower stamina cost, which is amazing. I don't understand why you would run this for just a few more damage when you can have a zero cooldown version. And then divine power for when you have the awakened form. So yeah. So the team I've been using for this monster mainly is being Shadow, um, Grifania and Skidcold. So Skidcold is a tank, of course. Uh, Shadow, um, three disables, any possible... Uh, barrier like she can remove every positive and trait from the enemies and Make sure that this monster is awakened So if you attack five times with this monster, which is gonna be fairly easy unless you have anticipation um, This monster will get awakened and if you turn transfer to her while she awakened um, She has a permanent skill mirror so reflects back gives it back to shadow and uh, the churn, so you get a churn both to you and Griff. I mean, you'll see in the game. Hopefully, I can I can be able to do that. But I'll show you in a second what I mean. So this is the combination. Uh, you've already already seen this thousands of times because it's a broken team. But yeah. All right. So no anticipation here. Yeah, no anticipation. So that's good. That's really good. Uh, do they have evasion? Is she rank five? Uh, yeah, she is. So. I will have to remove positive effects from him, that's fine. Um, I die because of whatever the um, sunburn, but that should be fine. Hopefully he doesn't have relics that damage me. And he does of course, but it's not a big deal. Alright, we can trade disable this monster, uh, you know, do what Shadow does. So. As you can see, this will awaken Grifania, and once she's awakened, she has the permanent uh, skill mirror vir virtue. So if I do this, look, I get turn transfer. So I give both her a turn and me. So I'll, I'm gonna keep cycling for a bit. I remove some of the usage from his relic because um, she is also dark and doesn't take as much damage. And you know what? I have enough turns so I can do this. I remove negative effects. Then use Divine Power to get damage boost and extra churn, which means two extra churns because of the skill mirror. And then I can just obliterate them with my attacks. So one, and I'm gonna end off with the ultimate. So, oh no, I don't need to. Man, be quick. I'm gonna end with this. Look, 3 million damage, that was insane. So, another good thing about this monster is the fact that she has like four different damaging skills like for four different elements so if you run all of the elements you're able to target for weakness fire which is meta um light which is incredibly meta um uh what's it called oh we got a thedon on the enemy side that's cool oh but he's low level okay so this shouldn't be a big deal man this this player is probably like pretty new uh, because he doesn't have high level runes, but like you're lucky having that monster. God damn. I wish I had Thedon. Thedon is actually like my second favorite out of all of them. Because like I love Deniers, I love what he can do, so yeah. But this doesn't save him from dying, you know? I, I think I should be able to OTK everyone. Hold on. Let me do this. Yeah, no, I, wait. No, I'm not. Okay, now I am. Woo, I can kill everyone. That's cool. Yeah, that's just... That shows how powerful this monster is. She's level 120 only, so... Uh, not only, but, you know... 
it could be higher. Uh, she's fa facing uh, much higher level monsters, so... Uh, oh, oh my god. Okay, this team combination is pretty strong, so... Um, hopefully I can uh, get away with winning here. Okay, so Baba should be able to remove positives, then the stamina drain gives him more uh, charges. Wait, what? Huh? Alright, I don't understand what happened. He should be awakened, but... Uh, I mean, thank God he isn't. So what effects do I have? So he is pretty, like, damaged, but yeah. This team is also really fun. I'll try to get uh, Bashir after Grifania, but yeah. So I was saying, after this uh, battle, I'll try to um, change up a little bit. I'll try a different combination. Yeah, hold on. Uh, do I die next turn? Yeah. What a shame. Anyways, uh, this should reset my cooldowns, which is good. Uh, she has, uh, he has three charges, so that's cool. Uh, I'm gonna kill Uriel right now. Okay. So that makes Grishvani awaken, and now we just need to... Okay, Uriel will die. I think Bashir has the... Um, hold on. Yeah, Adventurer's Essence, which is pretty annoying. So I might have to give her multiple turns, so she doesn't go in trouble, but I don't want to, you know, do too much. Oh, okay, we can OTK with uh, AoE since he's water, um, and that, and he should bring back with the essence both Uriel and um, himself. So I'm going to take down... Uh, who do I take down? Honestly, I'll take down this guy because I feel like he's more of a threat, yeah, with um, his skills. And you know, being able to protect these two. So I'm, uh, I'm, a, I'm gonna try to freeze Bashir, and I, I did it. So that's cool. Oh, Uriel brought the, the, this monster back. That's bad. Uh, Griffonia should die, but she comes back, so that's uh, cool. I uh, should finish off Baba for good. Um, let me apply the shield. So does he still have Megaton? Yes, he does. Oh, no more. Oh, that's bad. That's pretty bad. Oh, damn, okay. Yeah, that was a strong team. I uh, misplayed that probably by killing this monster, but that's fine. So, moving on, I'll try to change it up for a bit, so give me a second. Alright, so right now I'm going with um, K9 uh, being a support, uh, Sorcerer is going as a denier uh, next, and Griffonia, you know, being the main attacker for this team. Actually, let me put a uh, team speed on her. Because I think she's far too fast. So, thank you. So, let me see the stats real quick. Yeah, he's fast enough. So, this should hopefully work. Like, I'm running like a denier. So, she's more of a supportive role. The game doesn't revolve on her mainly. And she has more allies to support her. So, that hopefully uh, will work. So, let me trade this able here. Which should, you know, help us a bit. She removes uh, positive effects, which is good for us. Uh, I'm apply frosted to you. Um, oh, uh, yeah. So I apply frosted again, um, and then do bane of ice. So these two are denied and don't go next turn. And then I'll get rid of Uriel um, with Griff. So yeah, like this. I think they should awaken her. If I'm not gonna lie. If I'm not mistaken, not not gonna lie. Well, we get a point. So yeah, they're frozen. They cannot do anything. He goes next, removes the torture. I'm gonna heal too, because that would be pretty beneficial. He does that. I don't remember what it's called. Um, this does little to nothing, but that doesn't matter. So yeah, okay, this is working very well. I didn't imagine this to work as well as the last one. So I can do this now. Um, he's dead for the first time. He's gonna come back and I'm gonna kill him with uh, this guy, hopefully. Oh no, I don't. Okay, so he can attack, but he doesn't have Pierce, so that's fine. I shouldn't die to this, hopefully. Hopefully, please stop attacking me. Okay, yeah, I'm good. Oh man, okay, this was a close one though. This was This went pretty well. I like this game. So, yeah, this works out actually really well. Um... I was able to deny and, uh, you know, take a lot of their time, which was really good, so 
Yeah, this works out. I didn't imagine it would, but that's cool. So let's do a few more battles with this. Let's see how it works out if we have anticipation or something like that. So, yeah. Um, we have to remove a lot of positives, but we have this monster for that. Does anyone have anticipation? No, they don't. So I'm going to do this to Uriel. So it's easier to um, get rid of his effects. So I'm going to do Eternity Curse on this monster to remove the evasion. And then do this to deny... Oh, wait. I have to deny these two, so I'm going to do that. Without removing Elvira's evasion. So he's frozen. He is frozen too. And to get rid of Elvira, I'll use Riff uh, with her um, pure skill. Alright, so... Next off, uh, Uriel is dead because of the essence. And that's... I mean, that's why I wouldn't prefer anything over the Shadow's Essence. Oh, oh fuck, I, I, I forgot about that. Um, anyways, I was saying that I wouldn't get anything over the Shadow Essence because it can counter Essences overall. So if you have an Earth Monster, it can kill them pretty easily. Um, and you, overall, it can deal a lot of damage, which is really good. Alright, so Sorceress died. That's a shame. Anyways... Let's kill this guy. <laughs> he should come back to life. That's completely fine. Let me do... Let me heal. And then I'll do the water attack. On who? Hold on. I'll do it on Uriel. Because uh, he might bring um, this guy back if he dies. And the uh, drown will kill him. Yeah. So that was good. Uh, that was pretty good. Again, this, this team is working out so well. What? I might as well have to, you know, use that for... Uh, my main team, because this is working out incredibly well. Alright, so you don't get awakened instantly, but that's fine. Oh, okay, I think this one is gonna stomp me off a little, because we have this monster going first, and he does remove a lot of positives with this kill. So, he goes away. Awakened, I was saying. Um, I can... Oh, what should I do? I don't know what I should do. I'm gonna do damage boost, and he removes it, of course. So I, I must not let this guy attack. If he attacks, I'm screwed. So I'm gonna do this to him. So yeah, CDA, more damage and I need to land. I, I need to be lucky and land the freeze. So please land it. I didn't, that's unfortunate. He should die for the torches though. He has double damage, which would wreck me normally. Oh, I think it's just Griffani after this attack. Desire arrow, yeah. Okay, so this is bad. Uh, Griffani is the only one left. Uh, what do I do? I honestly don't know what to do now. Because he goes next and he's gonna absolutely destroy me. And they're both... And these two are also really strong. I don't know what to do now. I'm gonna do this and hope for the best. I'm gonna just do... Oh. Well, it's not even... Yeah. Okay, 3 million damage. That's insane. That's why I wanna get Baba, because... When you have him leveled up, he's so powerful, and yeah. Also, he looks so cool when awakened, like, he awakens and becomes a beast compared to the normal, like, little version. Let's do another one. So, uh, one thing, a little note uh, to take care of. If you are worrying about the channel if for some reason, um, I'm gonna make some videos every now and then, um, so yeah. You could somewhat look forward to that if you are, you know, looking forward to videos. But if you're not, you know, whatever. What am I even saying, bro? Well, one thing, one strong thing that this team has compared to the other one is the fact that it counters anticipation better. Because, you know, you're not using so many extra turns like the other team. Even though Shadow was good for damage boosting against light monsters and stuff. I don't know, man. I just am liking this better. Alright, so I think he will kill- wait, what? Oh, why would you do that? That's so bad. It's actually a pretty bad move. I will make sure not to attack that monster, and you know what, I'm just gonna recharge with him. Uh, so, recharge, I get to kill him. Yeah, okay, that's good. So we have the attacker out of the way, and these two won't be too hard to take down. Hopefully, hopefully. Uh, so let me apply double damage to him, uh, let me freeze and curse, so that will apply freeze on them. Oh, I also get awakened, that's cool. 
So if they attack me, they get their skill um, put back onto them. So if she doesn't have anticipation anymore, I can do my damage boost for extra damage. So one and oh. Well, oh my oh my double damage, I forgot about that. I will not ult on this one, I'm gonna do this. Uh, she comes back with anticipation, I forgot about that. Well, I'll kill her for good and then I'll get rid of this guy. So, hopefully it doesn't AoE. No, it, it didn't do anything. Well, let me uh, apply more torches for fun. Um, and yeah, this should be it. Pick and flight is not good, uh, but I can do the ult to kill him for good. Okay, so here we go. We could end another battle successfully. I love this team. It's like, this is working out well. I, I like this. <laughs> So I'll try to come up with one more team combination just for fun, but I don't know what could came out, come out of it. Alright, so next I'm going with this. I know it's kind of wacky, but I just want to try for fun. So Griffonia's attacker, Cthulhu as denier slash support to remove, you know, evasion and stuff like that. And uh, Skid Cold as tank as usual. So Cthulhu as the, can use Kirdar's horn, which is good to remove tortures at the start of the battle. So yeah, hopefully this works. I cannot promise, but yeah. So I was saying about my channel, oh, we have... Okay, Anticipation really does not do anything, because we have no extra chance on this um, team. So we could start by um, doing this, hopefully it lands on him. And it did or didn't, I don't know. Yeah, it did, okay, it did land the fear on this guy, so that's good. Um, anyways, I was saying, about the channel. I want to start making videos again because I it was I'm gonna be honest it was the most fun I've had making videos in a while um, and it still is uh, so yeah they were kind of easy to make it was just overall fun because you have people watching and yeah so I'm gonna come back somewhat I cannot promise anything if I have something to do I will but in the meanwhile like um, you know I this video probably will be enough for a bit so I have Oh, okay, so th this is actually working out pretty decently. Um, let me... she has water weakness. I don't know, I want to kill her, so she doesn't annoy us anymore. Um, he has... okay, what do I do? What? Wait! Huh? When did she get... I'm confused. Okay, I'll do, I'll do this right now to um, stop him. Griff gets awakened. Where, where are all these coming from? What? Okay, I don't know where, where the, you know, essences are coming from. Not essences, uh, death countdowns. But that's fine. Oh, okay, uh, he's under CDA and we got rid of him. So, somehow this worked out again. Uh, this just shows how good of a jolly monster. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna say that ever again, but... How good of a <laughs> um, bonus monster to use where funny is. Like, she works in every single team you could put her in. So, because, yeah, she's just... An amazing attacker that's self-sufficient and yeah hopefully that explains it so here i'm gonna be pretty hard um it's gonna be pretty hard to fight these guys but that's fine okay i cannot stop her so that's not good let me do this on uh, this guy to remove that uh, to block him from attacking yeah, that doesn't matter because he got an yard by, um, no, oh my god, oh, I misclicked, ah, shoot, um, anyways, I'm trying not to swear, but I'm used to doing it on my other channel, so, yeah, I don't know why I'm not trying, fucking hell, I, 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 I don't care, alright, so I'm up, do CDA, oh, it only worked on her, so that's fine, uh, let me, I don't know what to do now. Do I get rid of her? Yeah, I should. So we have a one less monster, which overall should get us an easier um, run. Next, I want to get rid of one of these two, because Cthulhu by himself cannot do too much. However, um, this guy is very annoying. So I am going to do this. It is applied fear on both of them. And that's really good for us. 
uh, let's um, kill him as I said, um, which he should come back to life, but I have him to deny. So yeah, um, he's under CDA and has a torture, so no, um, not the torture. That, uh, fear, I forget the names, I haven't played this game in a lot. Oh man. Okay, so he ulted, but he reflected it on him. So now I gotta hope he doesn't have an essence, and he does, of course. Oh man, that was a close one, though. Um, yeah, that was cool. So I'll do one more battle, and I think that will be it afterwards. So I won't do one more battle, because in my recording, the last battle uh, cut out midway. So this is an outro, hopefully you enjoyed. And yeah, uh, hopefully I can find something else to make a video on. In the meanwhile, uh, I'll see you guys later.